What are the indications for an ABG? Let's go through some of them now. For the assessment of the patient's response to treatment strategies, such as mechanical ventilation. To determine the patient's oxygen carrying capacity. To determine the need for supplemental oxygen. For the diagnosis of respiratory, metabolic, and mixed acid-base disorders. To monitor the patient's acid-base status. For the procurement of a blood sample in emergency situations when access to the vein is not possible. And for the quantification of hemoglobin levels. What are the contraindications for an ABG? We talked about why we would want to stick an ABG. Now let's discuss why we would not want to. Not all patients are potential candidates for an ABG test. Here are the contraindications for sticking an ABG. The patient had an abnormal modified Allen test. If you're not familiar with this test, we'll talk more about it in the next section. The patient had blood clotting problems. The patient has a local infection or damage at the injection site. The patient is on anticoagulation therapy. The patient is taking thrombolytic agents. The patient has a disease affecting the blood vessels. And the patient has arterial venous fistulas or vascular grafts.